Hey, how's it going? Welcome back to the Social.in channel. This week on the Social Media Weekly, we're talking about Google's new incognito mode, which is not really an incognito mode. We're talking about Facebook's new content policy because of the European Union's new ruling. And we're talking about Instagram threads because you needed one more app to chat with your close friends. Let's get started. So the first story we have for you today is about Google's new incognito mode inside Google Maps. Here's the fine print. Google announced this feature a little while back before you used to be able to use Google Maps without signing in. Now you have to sign in, but you can tap on your profile picture and turn on incognito mode. Google will not personalize the experience for you, nor will they track your location history. There is a link in the description to the complete story right next to the like button. You can check it out there. The next story we have for you today is about Google Assistant and Chrome and Duplex. If you remember, one of the most interesting demos at Google's I.O. was Google Duplex, where an assistant would call up on your behalf and make a reservation for you. What was interesting here is that the assistant used to use speech fillers like hmm and aha. Uh -huh. So anyway, the internet was completely agog because of this demo. Google is now rolling out this feature to Chrome on web. So Android police has reported that inside Chrome, when you go to a movie ticket booking site, you can tap on the assistant button and Google will automatically fill in all of the information based on your past purchases. Going forward, this feature will roll out to more new things. It's quite interesting that Google Assistant is rolling out to Chrome. You can check out the full story in the link in the description. The next story we have for you today is about PHP version 7.4 and WordPress. So WordPress version 5.2 require that you have PHP version 5.6 in order to operate and recommended PHP version 7.2 in order to operate well. Now, WordPress version 5.3 is coming out, which includes support for PHP version 7.4. PHP version 7.4 has a whole list of new features. I won't bore you with the technicalities of it, but for developers, it includes support for typed properties, whatever they are. Interesting statistics here is that 22.2% of all WordPress websites currently run on PHP version 7.2. If you have an older version of PHP and you're running WordPress, we highly recommend you upgrade right now. Our next story obviously has to do with Facebook.com. So in the highest court in the European Union, they have decreed that lower courts can force Facebook to take down content which is derogatory in nature. So this all stems from a case filed by an Austrian politician called Eva Gias. Okay, I'm just going to call her Eva G for now. She filed a case in a lower court in the European Union, forcing Facebook to take down content which was disparaging about her. Anyway, so the European Union's highest court has said that Facebook has to comply. This decision has interesting repercussions because all over the world, you have lower courts which could be politically influenced. So you could have a local politician who could force a lower court to force Facebook to take down content which is against them. Our final story of the day has to do with Instagram threads. It's a new app from Instagram where you can communicate with your close friends as per Facebook. So if you're tired of updating statuses and having all of your millions of followers follow them, you can now update a status and have only your close friends see it. What's interesting here is that you can also update an emoji as a status. There you have it. That's the killer feature. And you can also set auto status updates. It's going to be interesting to see if this is another gimmick app from Facebook or if this one really works. That's about it for this week's episode. If you liked it, please give it a thumbs up. Drop your comments down below. Go over to YouTube and subscribe to the Social.in channel on YouTube. Ring that notification bell so that you never miss a video. And we will see you guys in the next week's episode.